clerks that sort packages, sort mail. A lot of mail is prepared by automation, put in walk sequence presently, but there's still a small segment of mail stream that needs to be uh, sorted by manual. So we're looking at uh, adding a full, or having a full complement so there's not any shortages in terms of uh, delivery as well as sortation as well as window services. And in one of the complaints was the the retail experience in terms of smiling, a customer comes to the window, you know, you want to, we have actually a, a training video that says it starts with a smile. And <laughs> you start a retail transaction off with a smile, it's probably going to end well. You start it off with a frown, probably not going to end too well. So um, we're working on that and, and, and we're aware of that. Just to give you a few statistics of uh, what we've accomplished so far in Warren, we have approximately, uh, well, we have 6,841 deliveries in Warren. That includes rural, city, and post office box service. We've delivered um, 7 million pieces of mail, letters and, and flat size pieces, as well as almost 400,000 parcels so far this year. So, um, you know, demographics of Warren, folks get a lot of mail, packages, and things like that. So, um, we uncovered with Mayor Sardillo, you had a, an issue where we didn't have your address in the, in the directory. We fixed that. Did you get your Florida bill, tax bill? No. <laughs> I have not, but I didn't ask for re-delivery. I'm going to Florida <laughs> okay. next week. Right. I'm going to pick it up. <laughs> but, um, we, we got your address in the directory. Uh, we got your uh, managed service point barcode on I'm seeing a lot bill. more uh, junk mail, so thank you. <laughs> <laughs> get the good with the bad. Uh, yeah. And uh, so, you know, with with flyer, we've got some out front. Uh, you know, please stop down. You know, I'll be up there. George will be there. We're going to have some uh, representatives from the Postal Inspection Service um, talk about some of the uh, initiatives they're working on. Uh, we'll be able to uh, sign folks up on um, informed delivery. Go right on on the website, and we'll guide you through there, so you can opt into informed delivery. And, uh, you know, we thank you for your patience. We've heard your pain, and, you know, we put steps into place to, to move it forward to, to fix it. And, you know, we want to give an excellent customer experience for our folks. You know, we're not the only game in town anymore. We have, you know, a lot of competition. Uh, you know, we fight every day for every customer, and, you know, we don't want folks to be dissatisfied with the postal service. We've been around more than 240 years, around uh, another 240 or more. And I hope to be around. <laughs> <laughs> but Mr. Schultz, I would, first of all, I thank you. You sound very sincere, and it looks like you have a good, strong plan. And we always appreciate military people because we know they're capable of doing great things. Thank you for your service. Thank you, Mr. But I do want to recommend, recognize one person. I have a post office box also. And I've got to tell you, Carl, and I don't know his last name, is wonderful. Yeah. Wonderful. He smiles. He yeah. does everything, and he's got to be the hot one of the hottest workers. I want to hire him from you. Yeah. So right. I, I want to make sure. Make it, there, you know, there are some very good people. Uh, as there in every every uh, you know organization, we have good, we have bad, and you guys have to make a decision on how to uh, manage that. So, but I do believe you. I tru truly believe that you're sincere in your approach. And I'll turn it back over to Carolyn, who's leading this initiative. Uh, well, I'd like to see if anybody has any questions or concerns. George, I'm going to start with you. No, I thank you. Uh, I know Mr. Marion, when he was mayor, he started this, and Carol Ann, you... Uh, I'm trying to finish it. Yeah, and you, <laughs> you, 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 and you finish it. So uh, I just want everyone to know it's been, it's been great cooperation and a lot of man hours, or women hours in this case, and thank you. Gary? I just think it's a wonderful uh, breath of fresh air, and I really appreciate you coming out. And people are really uh, happy to hear what you said, and uh, I did go to the post office uh, the day for yesterday, and I see the log was cut, and it looked very different. Yes. It's a beautiful building you have. It is. It's, yeah, it's a beautiful lot, and uh, Carl is great. He's great. We all love Carl. <laughs> we need more of him. Okay. Yeah, thank I you. I think, you know, starting this effort in 2015 uh, was a challenge. It was direct, and it's taken our community over here to get this accomplished, and we give you a lot of kudos, but you have to still this road to hoe and make sure that we get there. Uh, to Mayor's point, Lynn Williams, I think, is one of the, uh, one of the postal folks over at your place that goes up in uh, 
the West End, uh, terrific person. I mean, really did an outstanding job. Always smiling, always happy. Yes. So those are the people that I think, you know, need to be told that. Thank you. The smiles do go a long way. What I'd like to, I really appreciate uh, meetings that we've had. Uh, the fact that Congressman Lance came out initially with Bobby Goodman. Uh, what I would like to suggest, I know Bobby was talking about, you know, by Christmas, that all the packages get to where they have to go. So I'd like to suggest that after the first of the year, we reconvene sure. just to see where we are, where else do we have to go, because it keeps us in touch with each other. Our view, absolutely. Yes. Be excellent. You know, we want to be <laughs> business partners. You know, keep the constituents and customers happy. And uh, you're important to us. Every customer is important to us. Thank you. And we thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank, thank you. everyone. Okay, now I'd like to turn it over to uh, Mr. Donato, Deputy